I'm not an angry person, but sometimes y'all be pissing me off. People are telling me my dog looks skinny when I did my yard tour. Look at this dude. Ranger is not skinny at all. I mean, he, he is though. He's long and strong. But he's a Labrador and is a puppy. Come on, man. You cute. Anyways, guys, welcome to a brand new trip to the thrift video. I had to start off with that clip because y'all say I don't respond to comments. So, of course, I got to respond to the hate. Trip. Nah, I appreciate you guys who show love as well. Um, I'm outside of the Salvation Army. I was here yesterday and committed a cardinal sin in the thrift game and completely forgot my wallet at home and I had some grails. Personal file, tripping. So, hopefully they have some stuff today. There is a fat line outside the store because it's like half off day. But one of the workers said he has some tings for me. So I'm excited to see what he may beholdeth. But yeah, welcome to a brand new trip to the thrift and let's get it. All right, y'all, so uh, we have entered in to the sanctuary of thriftness. And unfortunately, they don't have anything that I found yesterday, but thus is life. And that's the price you pay when you leave your money at home. But um, I did manage to scoop a couple of consolation prizes. You have that small check over check stripes. stripes yeah. that's, that's what I like, what I University like. of that, Texas that's... pullover. I think that's kind of cool. And then um, we have a bunch of button ups that are noteworthy. You have that, oh, mate, it's great Britain. Go save the queen. Horrible accent. People roast me when I do it, but I'm gonna keep doing it because I can really only do an accent if I'm a hysterical British woman. Doesn't make sense, but it does at the same time. And then you have the uh, Toucan Hawaiian shirt. Nice. Look at that aqua chlorophyll on the leaf. That fool has that beak, bro, that pecker. Hold up. Oh my God. Look at this creeping through the jacket section. I rarely see one in the wild. You have the chaps, Ralph Lauren, size double XL. Oh my God. Look at the zipper. Look at the plastic. And look at those stains, bro. Are you kidding me? Ew. This is such a fire piece. But it's stained up. Dang. It looks like someone just straight wiped their butt with the sleeve. Oh my God. Hey man, you gotta do what you gotta do when you're out in nature. Let's just put it that way. If you guys were curious, yes. Sometimes you have to hit them with the jorts. Just look at that dad short action. Look at those knees. Wow. All right, man, I'm checking out. I'm checking out right now, and before I leave this institution of great thriftness, I found one last find, which is a week too late. You have the vintage Puma hoodie. Oh. This would have been perfect to go with the Puma kicks they sent me. However, some things just happen unaccording to my timeline and schedule, but this is so sick. I'm gonna hold on to it and uh, yeah, wear it with the next little shipment that I get. Perfect. Oh my God, it's a miracle, man. The clothes that I left yesterday are still behind the counter. What an absolute treasure trove. I'm blessed. Oh my God, guys. Jehovah done bless me, baby. Ah! Yes, sir. I know y'all see that sack on me. I know y'all see my white sack. Ah! Just look at this thing. Oh my God. Bro, I truly am blessed. Not only did they have the items that I left, right? But I want to give a big shout out to the homie Mike, man, who works at the Salvation Army because he blessed me with some grails. So let me show y'all what I have, man. Good Lord, today is starting off right. So these are the clothes that Mike blessed me with and I didn't put the camera in his face just because I wanted to make sure he was cool with me recording or not recording him. But University of Texas, Nike BCS National Championship jersey. Now they unfortunately did lose that game, but it's all good regardless. Next piece is an absolute banger. It is the color blocked, kind of cubism looking Christian Dior. Montessor. Got shadows everywhere, bro. Look at that. Oh my God, the tag says it all. This is such a crazy windbreaker. I'm so blessed, it's amazing. Born to be what? Born to be bad. Oh, you got the Tasmanian devil over here looking scandalous. Bro got his arms crossed, is not receptive with that body language. And then uh, look at this, skirt skirt. You have the Daytona 2001 t-shirt absolute grail and then the nike white tag banger blue smurf skin tone navy rendition nike 
and the Nike logos and the buttons, bruh. White tag, vintage windbreaker, hold up. I know y'all see that, man. Amazing. I'm amazing. Yeah, I'm all that. If I ain't on my grind, then what you call that? Anyways, we're at the family thrift. Let's see if this one comes through for can too. Fingers crossed. All right, y'all. We are live in the field. And dude, this is why I cross my fingers. My hope is restored in humanity and in the thrifts. We have a car full of fire and I just started dissecting this spot. You have the Chops Ralph Lauren beautifully striped polo shirt. Seven bucks. Seven! With the long sleeve action happening, Captain. And then brand new FUBU. Fat Albert on the side of my shoe. You got the FUBU hoodie. Four bucks. All right, this looks like a vintage starter little hoodie, but it is a new school New York Knicks. Look at the cufflets on that dude. Vibrant little citrus orange color scheme. And then you have a couple of Cardinals essentials. You got the clean little hoodie right here. Two birds, one bat, my favorite nature film. Y'all know, man, we getting freaky. Oh, then you also have the one bird, one bat rendition. Not quite as epic, but this is a reversible jacket. Pin striped, STL on the front. And then you got that super flawless red lobster interior St. Louis Cardinals. This is perfect. And then I got two little pieces of denim dynamite just about a TNT blow my hand off. You got that Big Mac brand. I think that's what that says. And then you have a light wash. This is crazy right here. Shout out Beyonce and the whole uh, Super Bowl little halftime show. You have the Pepsi sponsored. Nothing else is a Pepsi. Seven. Seven! Oh my God, bro. This person had a huge wiener, straight up. Look at these though. You have the decomposing fall leaf color scheme, Ian Connors, for 10. Wow. Bro, oh, the true religions? <laughs> Let's get it. Dude, if these fit me, this is an instant cop. You guys know I love gold. These things are encrusted with that Green God's Vault interior. Dude, these are my size. What's up? Come on, I just got excited. Look at this. Size 12, size 12 for the Dubski. The pink and gold blazers, literal gum bottoms. And I'm talking double bubble. These are sick. I'm gonna clean them and I'm gonna rock. Guys, <laughs> I'm so grateful and thankful, bro. Look at this, we got some light work with the vintage 1999 Rams crew neck, vintage Arkansas University. You got the Nike small centered check Cardinals hoodie. That's so sick, I love the embroidered swooshes like that. But then this piece, God save the queen. I'll say it once, I'll say it twice, I'll say it a thousand times. Check out the details, Adidas patch. Look at the ribboning, the lines. You have the English flag, seven dollars. Bro, on the inside, it has the year 1982. We have this vintage banger of a jacket. Look at the zipper. All white Adidas stripes just draped up and dripped out going down the sleeve. And then look, you have the Varsity Elmo fur texture, England written out on the back with the Adidas logo in the A. This is a vintage relic. Are you guys joshing me? Let's get it. Oh my God, man, sun is shining. And we got them big bags, baby. Yeah, y'all know what time it is, dude. So, um, the thrift definitely came through for can too, man. I love it. Ooh, I need that for tax purposes. Bro, two sacks. Get at me. And we've arrived. Next stop, Family Thrift Outlet, baby. The plug. Oh my God, bro. This Skeletor got no lungs, but he's still hitting the ganja, my brothers. Let me dig in the back of the reefer though. We got the street vibrations. Hold up. Oh, y'all. We got three of them. All oh, three of y'all. All three of y'all. Look at this. This is hands down one of the hardest crew necks I've ever seen. Nike, made in USA. Vintage Oakland Raiders crew neck with that swoosh. Bro, that is a huge check. And then you got the Nike just do it. Huh, Nike white tag, look at the back. Got the end right there, built to compete. Look at that little drop shadow too. Hey, 
attention to detail. Nice. And then last and not least, you got that like Courier typewriter font pro player, baby. Yes. Aw, oh, snap. <laughs> Yo, guys, we got a live one. Check out this Dragon Ball Z trunks tee. Oh my God, circa 2000. What a great number and a great year. The front is simple. The back is extravagant. That's what I like to see, man. Hold up. Just in case your booty is a little anticlimactic, man, this t-shirt will definitely draw all the attention. That is fire. Wow. Oh, holy hell, man. I'll love nothing more than this Clydesdale to impregnate Trish the blonde hair bitch. Just look at the genetics. That fool is thick. <laughs> Bush Gardens. Vintage tea, baby. I'll take it. Oh, man. Yo. The denim department is coming through today. Look at this, Tommy jeans, vintage hill figure crest, embroidered, semi-worn, and uh, aged in like fine wine. You have the Tommy for your mommy denim jacket, nice little tan hits on it, and then, bro, that wool interior. But uh, this jacket is pretty cool, aside from the urine on the shoulder. Oh my god. Damn, this person had a pet raccoon. What's going on? This thing is a little tattered, brothers. Uh-oh. Y'all check out these two crazy vintage tees. You have the Honeymooners 1992 Address the Ball. Hello, ball. T-shirt right there. And uh, look at this banger right here, daddy. You have the Animal House Vintage Universal Studios tee. My, my dear, dear God. god. Oh my god. Hey, what frat are you rushing, bruh? Dude, this thing is so crispy in all ways, shapes, and forms. That is a must cop. Yes! I gotta hit it one time. Stroke, Stroke my, my cactus. cactus. It's lit! Y'all know the motto, man. Raise hail, praise Dale. It's senior, baby. Man, I remember the day he died. The newspapers came out, he was on the front page, and I was just stuffing them in people's like little water meter things. I was a hooligan back then, and uh, yeah, the statue limitation definitely is up on that. This is so nice. Nice! Oh man, God bless America, no plague sales, goddammit. Look at these little pieces right here, man. You got the Diamond Collection by Starter, Philadelphia Phillies. Got the Liberty Bell right there, man. Hey man, if it wasn't for the fine, found the fathers of Philadelphia, we wouldn't even be here to create alternate Ralph Lauren logo flags. God bless. I love these, man. That Tip City, Ohio. Oh, Sean Smith, that color scheme. This is what they mean by red bottom. That fool got that cherry ass. Let's get it. Y'all, check this jacket out, man. They have the Carhartt heavily distressed. Definitely was on a work site or two. Or maybe they just hit this with a nine millimeter distressing. This dude looks like he took a couple shells to the torso. Man, this jacket is just distressed to perfection. Any of you boys who are afraid to get your hands dirty but look like you do, this is the jacket for you. Carhartt. Oh my God. Guys, did I just discover a unicorn in this thrift? Check these out. Oh! Dang, those things are cracked. Got it. <laughs> Bruh, you have the beautiful Air Jordan 12s. What size are these? These are like damn near size 15. Hold up, they're probably my size actually. These are size 13 French blues in the thrift. If these were not all type of cracked up right here, they would be a great shoe to find, bruh. Oh my God, they're still only $2, but like, what am I finna do with these French blues? Lord have mercy, man. Trippy. I mean, these came out in 2000. That's the date on these puppies right here. So, I mean, they are 20 years old, but dang, they're still holding up swagnificently for their age. And then next door, oh my God, these look horrible. You have the Jordan 13 Lowe's. What the heck got on that, bro? thing got inked um yeah these are size 13 as well but unfortunately these puppies are talking to me just a little bit damn two pairs of jays all messed up oh my god and then you have the customs this is what happens when you use just walmart paint bro hey man either way that's art this is what you interpreted to be. Red suitcase look like some tiger 
cooks. Look like vodka cranberry tiger blood. All right, boys and girls, we're en route to the next spot. Wish I had hope we'll come through with some fire. Let's jump in and see what's coach. Guys, check out the scenery, man. We're live in this store and something unprecedented just happened. Unprecedented. Bro, I'm just too excited. Check out these finds. All right, hold on. I'm gonna put these to the side. Look at this, wolf crew neck. Very cool, right? Five bucks. Another outdoorsman wolf crew neck. Very cool. Carhartt jacket. All right, really sick, right? North Face, Denali, seven bucks. Okay, that's cool. But now we're getting into the sauce. Look at this. Logo seven. Seven! Vintage LA Rams. They're asking 20 bucks. All right, they are tripping. That is taxed. Tripping but it doesn't say St. Louis. This is straight Los Angeles Rams, right? Then you have yet another one, Dallas Cowboys. Logo Athletic, bruh, the blessings are coming in. Of course it has that uh, nacho stain on it. That's eight bucks. Look at the jewelry. But then last and not least, in terms of the heavy jackets, bro, you have the Kansas City we're out here chiefing, Super Bowl champs, Apex, NFL, exclusive jacket, $8, bro. Hold on, look at the back too. Arrowhead logo, no stains. Bro, this jacket is crazy. But then that's not even it, man. You got an Aquaberry jacket right here, 10 bucks. But this one, you have that Tommy for your mommy jeans jacket bro look at that big flag flag in the zipper big flag right here 10 bucks are you joking me look at the little wrist zips bruh this piece is insane and then that's not even it <laughs> then you got some levi's hooded denim jackets bro this store just smacked and i did not expect it whatsoever fuck with me fuck with me bro no lie I have not had a day like this since like 2013, 2014, bro. You have the Nike made in USA on the racks, $6 piece. Look at this, Nike, all embroidered. Dude, I promise you guys, today is unprecedented. I gotta take off the mask just so you guys can get the full depiction of my happiness levels. Look at this stack we got. We got this vintage wolf crew neck all over print st louis cardinals vintage gap yeezy you got the rams vintage blood light vintage wisconsin huskies vintage st louis rams vintage i survived the supreme scream vintage and then uh, another gap yeezy and then the vintage nike pieces yo we're not even done yet look at this harley davidson tide it five bucks Let's go, man. Just that tie-dye job is just nuts. Even the houseware section is coming through. You got the Houston Oilers cup for a dollar. And then, bro, they have a 2006 iMac in the building, bro. What the heck? This is like $40. Some of these go for like 100 but I have no way of telling if this thing works. And it needs a keyboard. And it needs a mouse. Bro, that's wild. Bruh, what on earth is happening in here? <laughs> Yo, and they got an air fryer. Guys, this is straight up dumb, man. We're out the store and just look how fat this cart is. Bro, it is full of so much stuff. This is absolutely absurd. One of the best thrift stops I've ever been to, like in years, bro. Like I used to do this on a weekly basis at stores and the game has gotten so messed up that it is almost impossible. I got an iMac. I got an air fryer and I have like, I don't even know, like $300 worth of clothes as well. Stupid, man. But you guys know, man, we lit. And all right, my brethren, so we're back from the trip to the thrift. Obviously, it's another day, another dollar. 
We got a little kinky in the building. I know you guys have missed him. And uh, yeah, dude, if you want anything you guys saw in today's video, check out thriftheavenvintage.com. Link down below, that's my website. We have a big drop happening today and pretty much almost every day. So yeah, follow the Instagram and check out the website. And we have a bunch of clothes to throw up on there as well from today's video and from other thrifting adventures. Also, I tried to hack into the Mac or the iMac that is from 06 and someone downloaded a version of Linux or Windows on there and I could not crack into it. This shit is too much, man. So that was a complete waste of money, but still worth the try. Anyways, love you guys. Live the dream, eat that ice cream. Until next time, I'm locked, I'm loaded, and I'm out. Peace. Killing these songs, leaving them bloody live by Rooster. And I'm in it to win it, so I'm somebody that you should get used to.